and strokes can be catastrophic. You're one way before and you're another way after. My name is, is William Patnot. I'm a, what they call a clinical neuropsychologist. A stroke is, is a disruption of blood to the brain. The blood carries oxygen and nutrients and energy. When you have a disruption of those things going to the brain, then the brain has a hard time functioning. If that goes on long enough, we actually start getting cell death. And once we get cell death, it's a done deal. Cells do not grow back. And so one of the challenges we have is to make sure that if someone is having a stroke, that we get them treatment as soon as possible. What we're asking the brain to do is rewire itself. That's called neuroplasticity. But we can't use part of the brain now because it's dead because of the stroke. So we've got to figure out workarounds to do that. One of the things I often tell folks is when we have something like a stroke, we're one way before and now we're another way after, we have to learn to get good at what we are. Use that as our foundation and let's move from there to see where we can go with that. Some people can do some things not as well. Sometimes people can't do them at all. And how do we compensate for that? Part of what we do when we have a stroke is redefine ourselves. And maybe I can't do the things I used to do or maybe not do the things at the same level I did before. But the idea that I can participate in something, that I have relevance and significance and meaning and purpose in my life, that's a very important ingredient in terms of what's going on. And so the recovery is really pretty individual too. Uh, oftentimes it can be just lifelong.